Oh no. What? Did they, he did he drop the video? What? We're in now. Because I don't know. I'm not, I, yeah, Brad. I'm not saying it loud. Right, let me. Just <laughs> show, show Chucky, please. Let me see. Let me call it. Oh shit! Oh shit! Mm-hmm. Oh, I, I saw this. Yeah. I thought it was something about something else, but I didn't even track it was that. I thought it was about you know the the other team. Low, if this is a this is I don't know what this is, but Lowski and Diggity have a problem, don't they? It upsets very, me, man. It's over gap. Does it? Well, it's not over gap. Yeah, because I like I like um, Lowski and I like um, Diggity. I don't want to have a dab to them either of them. I don't want them to cuss each other. I don't want them to do any of that. I, I actually like both of them. So do I, you know. Yeah. So do I. I don't. Do you know what? I yes. think that yeah. whatever it is that they've got going on is not going to spill into anything mad. Nah. But. But f- feelings are definitely being hurt. <laughs> feelings are definitely being hurt. And you know what is funny here is that like the way that a lot of them seem to be getting at each other is through gal. Because <laughs> this one's checking that gal, this one's with this gal, and this gal was with this one and that one. I can't keep up with it all, bro. Do you know what I lets me know? Keep up with it all. Do you know what lets me know? Go on. Then I choose the wrong gal. But this is oh my god. That's exactly what I was... When I watch that, that's exactly what I'm thinking. I'm like, it's a stinker because you lot are picking constantly the wrong ones. I've been there. Constantly. I've been there. Constantly. Never going back. This one's with, like, you're seeing it at the table with this rapper and that. I can't. You know what? I don't know how them lot do that because the reason why I don't know how they do that, yeah? There's so much money in this thing right now Man are having all kinds of stuff in their yard and they're just having these type of girls in their yard and in and around them. That would make me incredibly paranoid. Brother, I don't mind the man them doing what they do. I don't mind anything anyway. But I'm just saying, I'm with you, Chucky. You see when you're out and you're socialising and you're doing your thing? Come on, we're all having a good time. But you can't bring that back home. No. Not even to use the toilet. No. Not even if she says, you know what? I feel a little bit parched. Big man, there's a sweet shop on the corner. That's strong. Them gal can't just be a rat like, I don't know. Fam, we're kings. Us look like kings. You have to be around queens. Do you know the thing is, to be fair though, that's ne- it's, that's never not been a thing. The same people are in the same circle. No. The same I, gal. I, I, you know, like they're always at the same club with the same. I'm talking about a permanent fixture. I don't mind the away days. I don't mind like little. You know little getaways where it might be a month? Mm. Calm, calm, innit? But this gal is in your yard. She's hearing your conversations. You're exposing so much. Sometimes you might have a you. And these are all L's. we got to drop them gal out. I'm being honest with you. you know There's too the... many amazing women for us to settle I for hear. that. But Why are we over there? See when you're young, like, you're low ski without patronising him. Mm. And Digger, they're young still. Like, they're obviously... They will one day get to that point in life where they will be able to understand certain things, even not just about women, but about themselves, yeah? Mm. So I'm thinking, you know what? Maybe, maybe if I was in their position, I would still, I would probably be in the same type of mix as well. Would I be in the situation where I'd be beefing man over these type of gal? I don't think so. I just don't know if that's within my, within my remit. I, yeah <laughs> to be honest with you i never i don't like to argue like obviously some things from a distance can look a particular way but in terms of context i don't want to argue about a girl you can tell you can ask girls when i'm with them mm. i've been in a dance with a girl one of my exes a man's felt like a rude boy is with 16 boys and he's gone to talk to my girl mm. you are a rude boy i'm not but mm. that's my girl i have nothing to fight for here if you want to talk to her and flirt with her and do all of that I wait in the car. Do you know why? Because I don't care. Where's she going back to? The car. Mm. Did she speak to you afterwards? No. Did you do anything? No. So I ain't gonna let my ego get involved. It's just. Do you know what the matter thing from? is? Originally, them man there wasn't even arguing over it. Them man were cool. Yeah. I guess it always starts like that, innit? It always uh-huh. man are cool. You're on this side. I'm on that side. Whatever. We might even run a rhythm. Whatever it may be, yeah. And then all of a sudden, it just goes mad, and then. The going mad now spew, spews into the internet. And then it just like, egos get in the way. Egos, 
<laughs> and <laughs> selfishly, I can't play certain songs because now you're cussing each other. Oh. I didn't even know there was a song that the intro to Diggity's tape here. Not, I think the last tape was the Pyrex um the Pyrex tape. Brother, you I didn't play. even know he was sending for man. And I'm playing it, listening to this intro, thinking this is cold. Did someone come to you? Someone come to me like, Paul, you know he's talking about my... I can't don't play it no more. I can't be singing along to that thinking it's just someone ignorantly and rare, rare, rare. Then I found that it was... I said, no way, cuz. I said, you know what? Man can't really sing that. I know some people like his only music, this, that, and the other, but still. I'm just not... I just don't want no drama, cuz. Do you know what? I've talked about this before and I'm going to talk about it again. I hate the fact that these men, not just them two, but these men will just not get on with each other. And then me, as a DJ, who's not in the mix of anything, who's not playing at a club in any one of those areas. It's not like I'm playing at a club in fucking by their estate. I'm playing at a club in fucking, I don't know, Bournemouth or some shit like that. And now a man's t- coming up to me telling me, nah, don't run that rhythm. What are you talking about? Don't come to the fucking club then. How are you going to be in Bournemouth and you're going to be upset that I'm running a digger or you're going to be upset that I'm running a fucking Lowe's? Like, it's mental to me. If you ha- if it is that triggering for you, don't come to the fucking club. The guest is upstairs, and I agree with you. Oh, You're he's going to love this one. He's going to love this one. Oh, Let's pause it now. He's going to love this. Thank you so much, the guest. Yeah. We've got someone up past true. Up past... What? You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. PT. Yeah? Will I recognise? Huh? You will. Yeah, I will. like you, East Africa. I didn't reveal the name. <laughs> <laughs> he was confused. Yeah. Brother, we're how much filming this man done? How much man is filming this man done? We're in, man. Where the mic? Brother. Where the mic there? Where the mic there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Share. Yeah. Yeah. Firstly, right, share. Right. Right. Shall I go over there then? Share. No, 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 no. You hear that? Lippy! Someone a pass true, yeah? Someone a pass true. Someone a pass true. Just come true, yeah? Yeah, man. It feels right. You know what? Like we were just already in the conversation about flipping, com- a light conversation about um, about what's his name? Lowski. Lowski and, uh, and Digger. Yeah. That I was. Ju- Listen. Yeah. Like, I know the man. That, if I show the WhatsApp, bro. But yeah, just, nah. I'm I'm honest, I don't know the ins and outs of all of that stuff here. But I'm saying, right, it's mad, yeah, that like that these things spewing into like you see as a DJ now. Mm. I'm going now nah, and I'm playing in fucking Bournemouth. I'm playing in Bournemouth, and now all of a sudden I can't run a rhythm oh, in you, Bournemouth. Do you them saying don't play? They're saying no, you can't run that. We're team lost, you. Yeah, team we're team whatever. Like Jesus, it's mental, bro. And the reasons why like, I can't understand it is because who the hell wants to sit in a dance and let watch people being entertained by you cussing my friend? I'm not on it. I hear that. I might I hear leave. that. No, don't I'm, go to don't go to the club. No, no. With my mentality and how I am, of course I'm leave. I'm not a rude boy. I'll leave. But. Certain of my brethrens, they're not leaving. You have to leave. The DJ might all have to leave. Yeah, yeah so I, Bournemouth, I get it. though, it's different. Diff- very, it's when different. you're in my man's end, it's cool, I get right. it. Right. But Bournemouth. Bournemouth. But, Where but imagine, safe, this. Bro. Um, imagine this. Imagine you've left, um, from their perspective. Uh-huh. You've left your house to have a good time. You arrive in Bournemouth. Buff gal. You're leaving London to get away from that noise. Mm. Is there and then the DJ starts running though? the rhythm. I don't think so. Yeah. Is there Buff gal in Bournemouth? What? Shola Amma's in Bournemouth. Yeah, but does, she's not from Bournemouth. It doesn't matter. She's there she's right there. now. Nah, I'll go there then, still. If I see but Shola Amma in a dance, I'm paying my respects and walking away. Honourable shout-out to her. Honourable shout-out to the Bournemouth girl. Come yeah. on, man. She's and like, yeah. the house over there are wavy as well, so there must be some nice girl. But I understand mm. their perspective, Chucky, but I understand your thing. You're just doing your job. If I'm in your ends and I'm running the rhythm in your ends, I get it. Yeah. I get it. Yeah. But if you've gone out to party somewhere outside of your ends, you can't dictate you the move. You've got to affirm it, man. You, got you can't it. dictate the move. Mm. You're not paying me. Mm. Even then, I'm playing in your ends. You're probably still not even paying me. Uh, oh, yeah. There you go. Do you understand what I'm saying? It's never, you're not even providing fees. I'm with you, look. I'm on top of that. You're not even giving me a money pull yeah, up. Yeah, it's not even that. I was just about to say that. You even got a score for a man or nothing. Right. You, you give me a money pull up. If you. All right. Let's see here, here where we're going now. All right. I'm running some rhythms early or whatever. A man's like, yeah, boom, money pull up. Yeah, pull that one up. Yeah, money pull up again. Like, he's mm. loving the vibe and whatnot. Then I play a tune from my op. I didn't even know. If he then comes over to me and says to me, nah, I'm not like that one there. I might listen to that still because mm. he's providing with yeah, the money yeah, pull up. Yeah, yeah, you understand yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. He's showing me that he's yeah. invested in this thing. 
You can't just now not come with no money, pull up, we're outside the ends and all these type of things. Everyone's making bangers these days. Don't go to the fucking club then. What about, what about new thing, money skip? Money skip? So he ain't even ever seen you before, but he just said, brother, hold this 20 pounds. Skip, skip the rhythm. I'm on money, that. Skip. money skip. I'm on that. New thing. Yeah, new thing. <laughs> money skip. You just look MS. at him. Yeah, I like that. Just look money at a man skip. and just be like. Yeah, skip that one. All right, because I'm looking at it like this. Wait, that's a great one. That's a good one. That's a good one. It's Money's it's peaceful. Cold. It's peaceful. Imagine this. Chucky's playing in the dance. We're in mm. London. Mm. A new pusher r- rhythm's come out. Mm-hmm. Cold. Everyone's mm. playing it. Yeah. So happens that Drake comes to the dance at the same time. He's, you're playing the pusher rhythm, Drake's in the dance. Drake tells you to turn it off. What do you say? No. Rate that. That's what I want to hear. No. Unless, he, unless hear. he's giving me a money pull up mm. from early... Or if he's giving me a money skip. Yeah. And that's Drake. So that's that money skip's got to be different. Man, yeah, exactly. Score, yeah. Like, <laughs> mortgage. Yeah. Like, right, right, you better just mortgage what? money skip. Yeah, yeah. If he gives me a money skip, then yeah. Or I don't know. You know what? If a man maybe came up to me on a just like, you know what? Like I would appreciate it if like going forward in the set, mm. you just refrain from that or whatnot. Then I will respect that. But man are not doing that, bro. Man have come to me on a thing of... like one, I remember one time, I think this happened in Liverpool, actually. I played a rhythm, man came over. What? Whoa. Put his hand on the CDJ. Stopped the rhythm. Now, my ego's n- touched yeah, yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. Do you get what I'm saying? My yeah. ego's touched. What do you mean you're just coming in and just doing that? Like, that's different. That's yeah. mental. Yeah, yeah. That is mental. That's so mental. now me and him are having words about that. Oh, yeah, but no, I, you can't play tune from... Um, it was a digger tune. Can't play a digger tune or whatever. I'm saying, bro, I ain't got nothing to do with that. I ain't got nothing to do... And better yet, you can't come... You can't do that. Mm. You can't do that. Play the I, rhythm again. I, did you? Play the rhythm from the start. Yeah, man, start it. Do you give a sound effect, everything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, everything. 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 from the start, bro. No, That's like, you've got to have, you've got to have the chorus. I'm not involved in that, man. Yeah, don't involve man. me in that. He, do you know the worst thing is? He's not involved in that. Right. How about that? Right. That's all mad. You know, like that, bro. So now he's begging. Yeah, more time that is the case as well. But the worst thing is, a man that's involved would just sit there, vex. Slightly <laughs> tapping his foot. I've seen it. I've and seen the tunes it. are all right. You know them, man. They're just like, <laughs> tunes are all right. Sounds kind of right. likes it. Still. Sounds all right through the speakers yeah, yeah, still. Yeah, I never yeah, heard yeah, it yeah. In, yeah. in the dance before. It's like, do you know what it is? It's just... That's the thing I respect. I respect when the man says, I don't fuck with my man, but this tune's hard. Nah, it gets like that, man. It gets like that. I just can't do that. Nah, it gets like that. If I'm, if I'm, if I don't like you, Cuz, I don't even like the fact that you say letters. I don't like anything. I might all stop saying words you say. I not on it. And I very rarely don't like people. So if I don't like someone, hear your song in a dance. 100% I'm leaving. Can you separate not liking someone from their ability? Like liking or not liking? I can. I can separate not liking someone, but I can't separate like a fuck you. You understand? So like if a man's done some kind of wrong in this, like I don't, I don't care what his tune is is about but if I personally don't like a man I, I, that ain't gonna mi- affect my opinion on his music it might well, you mean like to- a social like a social wrong so say like he violated a girl or yeah like, something like yeah, that yeah, some yeah, kind yeah. of you understand it I'm gonna but don't get it twisted even still I'll be able to say but my man's good though yeah. I just don't listen to him because of X Y Z you understand I'm not on that I can't if lie. I don't like you it's probably because you've done something to me I don't like you I'm never going to prevent anything from happening. I'm never going to progress anything from happening. I just want nothing to do with you. I think it's safer that way. Because if I know you're... Uh, like, say I know that you're just a liar. You just chat shit. You're just a prick. And then you start giving me some realness in your track. I'm going to harbour feelings. I'm like, this guy's a liar. After you done boom, 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 boom. I don't want to hear music and do that. <laughs> music escapism. So I don't want to listen to you. You chat shit, you're a liar. I don't want to listen to you. That feels, that feels right. Yeah, you know what? Do you know where I'm coming from? That I feels hate. right. It's context for me still. I think uh, I'm on that. If there's like a super violation in some way, yeah, mm. then like R. Kelly. I'm probably not going to even put myself in a situation to even try. So we don't go back it. to R. Kelly. R. Kelly's a no-go. Yeah. And if Jeffrey Epstein made that album, that's a no-go. Yeah, man, I ain't even going to hear that. Nah, I'm, I'm not yeah. hearing that. I won't even listen to the ad lib. Mm. Do you know None what the that. difference is? If the different, oh, this is going to sound nuts, yeah. But the difference is, yeah, that when you're talking about Jeffrey now about to make a rhythm. If he's now about to make a rhythm, 
I'm not trying to hear it. Mm. But if he's my man's made rhythm. the rhythm. Yeah, he's been given rhythm. Right, and the and rhythm was hard. Then you've heard the info. Then I've heard the info. It's I hate it because I don't fuck with my man. But for however many years, I just knew it as hard. Nah, because you know what it is? Our parents must have went through something. Like, by the time we was listening to R. Kelly, it was all said and done that like, he was that guy. Imagine how our dad felt. Like, raw AJ, nothing but a number. That was my yeah. shit. That you dare. Every christening, bro. Every everything, happy people. You see, christening. Oh every Sunday event, I hear happy people. Not so much anymore. Yeah, nah. No, I no, think no. They got accepted now. Before it was yeah. like, you know what? Let's play all these bangers before he goes down for this. And it's like, nah, he's gone down for this. Thirty years. Yeah, you. Yeah, but well, you know what? As well, though, in that con- in the context of what we're talking about here, yeah. Yeah. The step in the name of love was the biggest fuckery still. Because Brother, I don't know if you know how that one was made. He made that one when he was going, for, when he was in the mud, yeah, <laughs> when he was in the proper mud and he was in the court, like doing, going through the courts and whatever, he then made Step in the Name of Love and gave family members percentage of the rhythm. So I... now man are not testifying and talking up in the thing or whatnot because there's percentages of Step in the Name of Love. He patterned the case. Big, big man. Can I tell you the realness, that tune is crazy. Bro. <laughs> I'm not gonna, bro. It come, Fam. it come up, bro. It come on in a rave the other day, yeah. The other day, no, broski. I'm telling man straight. I Where? Was in the dark. Do you know what it is? The yardy. Do you know what it is? The yardy. Do you know what it is? Every there's there's every section of a yardy dance. They'll just play some forbidden R and B. Fuck yeah. it, brother. And it came on. The man there. Went, Whoa, whoa. I said, oh, no. yeah. <laughs> I said nah, nah. I said nah. Seeing, bro, I'm seeing gunman, bro. Yeah, yeah. I'm seeing gunman. Yeah, doing the most for this rhythm. And I that said, covered you know all what? four corners of the world. Do you know what that was? Bloody Step in the hell. name of love was the earlier happy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Universal. Remember that for I'm happy. Yeah, that it was everywhere. that. Yeah. Step in the name of love had the whole world. Had the whole world, bro. Yeah, it step, and it was step, rooted step, in fuckery. Oh, my day. And they say you do the love slide. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Jesus. Yeah. Nah. We both step in. Yeah. <laughs> and oh. then you think about what, when December came and the, 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 PR, the PRS money dropped, the uncle and whatnot is nice with that. They're more than nice, bro. Bro, the, they're thinking of next Christmas. Right. They're saying, if he goes jail now, <laughs> this money ain't coming back again. Yeah, but look how many, how many, when did Step in the Name of Love come out? But that's like early, that's early 2000s. Brother, he was out here you, you, almost 20 years more. Let's, let's, let's be yeah, honest. Yeah. What album was that one? Chocolate Factory? I don't even know. Google. It was a, brother, yeah, no, don't even even This is a wax, this is a wax. <laughs> we don't even want to give out that this is, information. Yeah, this is, this is cave roll, <laughs> Next minute, it's just getting more spins. A lie. Un- <laughs> and the uncle's making more bread again. Oh, that's not man's fault, though. From the what? What? what do you Bro, mean? I'm hearing he's making bread from the wing. No, I'm saying that's Who? not. Who? Our Kendi, oh, Kendi bro. Bro. singing happy birthday to the Kinder's Dim's daughters. Oh, brother, you're on, the, on the phone, yeah. brother. Is he, brother? You're joking, bro. Imagine your dad's been gone thirty years. Yo, Chantel, I got somebody that wants to talk to you. <laughs> oh my, bro, God. what? <laughs> hey, how you doing? Your da- bro, people. Oh my day, bro. You're putting it on loudspeaker. Everyone in the cars doing. The- Did you not see the thing, Bob? Where he made the he they made R. Kelly sing. Happy birthday to this girl. Or, or sing Sutton. On the wing. On the on wing. The J- I've heard, I've heard that one. I've heard the voice. You on. can look up YouTube right yeah, now. Google not, yeah. that. He's doing it, bro. He, there's a fee. There's a there's a he's good. So he's Gerald Rich. No, he's good. He's good. He's good. He's he's I he, give up. In a way, he's the boss of the wing right now. You reckon so? Yes, he'll just sing a t- bro, imagine it's a mad thing. He'll just say, Listen, I will sing a tune to all your aunties every day, right now. But the man are out of the mud. So that man you spoken to their wife for 17 years in there, you know. But now you got Robert on the phone, brother. Robert, this is the man. Visit man gave him the give, give, the governor, Robert, bald head, leather waistcoat like he's stone cold. I never trusted him anyway. I told you, the front cover of that album. When he's in the background. This is why you're my brother. You have to look at the and details. And he's dressed like stone cold in the background. Yeah, Thank the you. And it's yeah. a depth of field shot. Do you know what that means? Oh my days. The start of it, the front of it, I can see clear, but in the background. Yeah. Bit blurry. It's obscured. Obscured. It's like one of them subliminal ones, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even the whole, just everything about it is fucking nuts, bro. But sometimes some people are not like, when you've, if you've liked something for such a long time, 
it's difficult for people to for some people to turn around and say yeah I don't even like or some people will turn around and say I don't really fuck with that anymore I don't even like it until someone runs the until someone is I don't want to say brave but whatever that word is runs the rhythm and then all of a sudden you're not telling someone to not play it Nah, R. Kelly. Manly, that's the thing. Man are not even keeping this. But there's all this energy for the man them to not play a fucking low ski or digger record or whatnot. But there's no energy to say, yo, yeah, Rob, you see the Robert thing? No one put your hand on the thing for Robert. No one know. did that. What do you mean? They'll turn it up? A lie? They'll say, we need it. That's money pull up. That's money yeah. pull up. I especially if they hear it. vibe. <laughs> especially if they hear vibe. Nah, do you know what it is? R. Kelly is a idiot. I was even on TikTok the other day. I scroll through a thing and the sound was I believe I could fly. I, I felt motivated, bro. Oh, I hate shit, him. bro. He's, He's still affecting, you know. bro. That tune is powerful. World's greatest. Oh, World's greatest. stop, stop. Oh, but stop, do, stop. what is he doing? Stop, why? Stop, stop, and this is why I'm upset, bro. I can't even look at man no more. This you know is mad. You know what it is, yeah. When I hear these, when I hear about them rhythms here, yeah, it just irritates me. How did he do this? How the fuck did he do yeah. that? And do the other thing. And that it makes no sense. Where? How, did he have in 27 one, hours in his day? Yeah, he had about. 58 hours in one day, 100. Brother, it's it's like it's mass no, manipulation, no, it is, it is, it is, and it's like it to a almost to a genius level. Yeah, if you is. applied that properly, if he applied that properly, you know, he would be in a different stratosphere. Yeah. Do you know the song he wrote for Michael Jackson? Stratosphere, what the Thank song you. he wrote for Michael Jackson is called You Are Not Alone. Oh it was about God. a 13 year old that was pregnant having an abortion and he was supporting it saying, <laughs> oh you God. are not alone. I am here with you. Big man, you might as well leave. Ah, bro. You might as well leave. Wait, R. Kelly wrote that? R. Kelly wrote that. For Michael Jackson? But it was for a 13 year old girl that he- It was about- yeah. a... <laughs> the And you know what? This is where it makes me go- This is a stinker. I can't eat. I always defend Michael Jackson, but now he's just done a song with you know what? You, right, but I can easily Flock. see how you would not know that though. What? You just hear in the re- it's a smash hit. Right. It was it's a video as well. He's alone in the theatre by himself. No top. That's who abortion. is Michael Jackson. Be there with a the short hair. That's when he come back with yeah, the bob. That's when he come with the bob. Come oh, on, man. Fucking and oh, his Presley's daughter. Oh my god. Oh yeah, shit. I forgot about yeah, that yeah, as literally. well. How old was she them times there? <laughs> She was Don't a, do that. Me she was a Elvis b- Presley married a 13 year old. Facts. Yeah. Well, look. Did he? Yeah. yeah he no, did. Diddy didn't. Elvis did. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest with you, though, to be honest with you, and I've said this enough times, enough people's granddads. <clears throat> Enough people's granddads are shook when they hear that door ring, you know. Why? Because they know what they did. Oh. Look, you see, back in the day, there was a lot of things happening. Enough man's granddad are shook. Nah, 100. They're thinking, <laughs> no, they're thinking, nah, like, you know what? They're hearing about certain things from however many years ago yeah. being stopped and whatnot. There's enough man's granddad is at home Stressing. Shook. Stressing. Stressing. You saying every time that door knocks at a yeah. at a funny hour, yeah, because it could be them. Yeah, it could be them. Back then, back then there was just certain things that were seen as acceptable. Yeah, bare neighbour. Excuse me, is Mr. Richardson here? Oh my I'm god. I'm denying himself, you know. Why yeah, not? All the letters me. is on the floor, Mr. Richardson. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, you're not here, you know. Yeah, yeah no. I am Mr. Williams. Son. His, his cousin. <laughs> <laughs> no, he got his <laughs> DNA, everything. <laughs> now you can take me, but it's not me. me yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> all, all of that, all, all of that. You know what that? You're about trying to say, accept what's me. going on. No, it's not me. We can't yeah. can go through but the it's procedure. Not me. Yeah. That's mad manipulation, you know. Yeah. When you know they take. Cuz. Yeah, nah. now. You know what? They all Jimmy got granddaughters man. now. Mm. You know what I mean? Some of them are all great granddads oh. and whatnot because obviously, yeah, there's all of that shit. Nah, and do you know what? Do you know how many of them have got bodies? Us. None of them have got bodies, you know? Yeah, no, brother, brother. Bro, there was no big brother. Broski, Broski, there, there is a famous story in Northwest. A man was shopping in Park Rail, yeah? <laughs> An undercover fed noticed him. 20 minutes later, a man's nicked for a murder that he done that 20 years ago, bro. What? They've been looking for my man for years. And he's just radioed in. It's him. It's one hundred percent. It's him. And was oh it him? It was him. It was him. They took him in, fingerprinted him, done him. Oh shit! Got like twenty five years. He's in like his mid fifties, so early sixties. He's, he's dead in jail then. 
And he was just out here. He thinking, just out. He didn't know he was wanted, bro. So even when they caught him, he was like, I weren't hiding. I was out here, bro. Oh, but he wasn't even He wasn't hiding. hiding, bro. He's like, I didn't know. They, he, he just done the... When they caught him, guilty, rare, all of that. He's banged to rats. When did Google when DNA first started? He was well? banged to rats. I, I, I think it was... I think when DNA was first being used in... Yeah, nah, let me... Let me brother, I'm going to find the story. Yeah, Serious? 100%. That's mad, bro. A man's out here in Tesco's every little house. I'm sure it was Park Royal getting... Asda. I'm sure. Asda? I bro, think so, yeah. Can't yeah. arrest sure man in Asda, 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 man. What's their slogan? What? Asda Press. 25 years. What? Brother. Man's patting the back pocket like... Doo, 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 doo. That's yeah. Asda, innit? Yeah. yeah. Fuck yeah, Asda, yeah. man. Just out here getting my brothers arrested. That's nuts, though. But if you... See, if you was doing... 83. 83? 1983. Serious? when um, DNA first started using, yeah. being used. Their first day, first conviction. So you had decades upon centuries upon centuries of fuckery. But the backlog, Matt and Matt the backlog's crazy. The That's backlog's mad, mad bro. But you know they what? Got Some man from the sixties that they need to test now. No. You understand? Exactly. Exactly. Fucking hell, well, think about it like this, yeah. Like obviously, there's like mass murder. A lot of mass murderers might have been caught or whatnot. But what about the don who just caught just one body on a one one bro. way, and that was it. And that's all he's ever done. It's just a little one thing in the 50s. Mm, nah. I know, that's mad. Because I know Bear Mark, like, family, nah. family in Jamaica that told me, yeah, in the 70s, 80s, nah, man was doing things in yeah, Miami. Drop, man. It was drop, man. crazy. Yeah, it, 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 back then, life, weren't, life was cheap. It's different. <clears throat> Straight to Miami or yeah. New York, and you're not even hearing from them again. Whole new life set up. I was watching... Um, that's mad. Do you know, I know you lot don't fuck with Vlad, yeah? But he mm. done a real good interview with Sammy the Bull. Do you know who Sammy the Bull yeah, is? Yeah, yeah. It's fucking sick, bro. I've seen. I ain't seen the full thing, but I've seen the clips. Do you know it's so? Ma- Sammy the Bull is um was like uh, he was an underboss in the Gambino family. Yeah. This man, when you hear about the stuff that was going on, not just what he did, but just the stuff that the mafia was doing mm. in mm. Brooklyn Ma- at a time, and you're thinking, like, he did. It's specifically him did all of this stuff and he's just outside. Didn't didn't brother correct he, me if I'm wrong, but they, he snitched on a lot of people in it. Yeah, yeah. There you go. So yeah, well, he, do you know what? See, the, he got five years for nineteen murders. You know. See that, what? No, but the, the info he gave up was it's like mental. compared to Frank Lucas and all these men. Mental. Nothing. Mental. He, he, he almost took down the mafia. Bro. Yeah, like literally, literally. But how is he still living then? Because all them men are locked up. Think, think. He's a powerful man himself, you know, and. What I think in situations like that, he must have man round him Still, or some kind yeah. of. You understand to go and do that, because he basically. That's mad, he bro. Was tra- he justified his move in like, in where he realized that the loyalty was just super off. Where that he realized that they were trying to kill him. Mm. Yeah. And oh, then, but so, facts though. Uh, mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They were they were trying to kill him. Well, what they were trying to do is they were trying to set him up. They was trying to get him to do a bunch of murders or whatnot, and then. Put, pin the murders on him, yeah. So anyway, yeah, cut a long story short. Even it was him. <laughs> so listen, see, you done it, but we, they need to know you. It's you. <laughs> nah, but back then it was like that though. Yeah. He was yeah, he was in a position of power. Yeah. You get me though. Like. The man's gonna make a man do it. And, but by the way, you did it. Yeah, we're gonna pin it on you. But it was me. Yeah, it was yeah exactly. <laughs> and then like, Fuck, it's a setup. Cause. But anyway, now anyway, boom, he's done whatever it is that he's done. But then like. Yeah, he ended up just he just snitched on he just snitched on everyone like literally oh, everyone yeah, no. he just told mm. but um Six yeah then then what he he said that um John Gotti tried to get him wigged but them times that he was on witness protection or whatever else he's come out of witness protection then he ended up shot in food and all that so the longest time he did in jail was for shot in food not for the murders mm. huh? so he did like after the five years he went back on the road again and it ended up getting twenty years for a next thing and nothing happened to him in prison. No, nah, do you know what he did, bro? Do you know what this man... No, nah, no, nah, he didn't. Nothing happened to him in prison. Do you know what he did? He duppied a brother, went to the funeral, and then, you see, like, when they have the open casket or whatever, mm. he's gone to the open casket and told my man, why did you make me do that? Yeah, hmm? yeah, that's what they're on. It's probably his brethren. Because, and what he was saying is, it was his brethren. See, he's yeah, saying, I love it. He said, I love the guy. He yeah. was like, but there's rules. And he knew that stepping outside of the rules, that this is, yeah. that was just gonna happen. Yeah. And yeah. he even said, like, I know that when he when I snitch, I know 
Like my life is on the line. That's the rules. I, I, I. You take a oh, blood you can't oath. Say that. Yeah, you can't say that. When you take a blood oath, yeah. that's what it is. So yeah. after I've done what I've done, yes, of course, man are gonna try to kill me. I can't be mad that man are trying that are gonna try to kill me mm. and that. But it just turned out that bare them ended. And then you gotta think that like society changes. There becomes more of Big Brother. There's more cameras. There's more things happening. It doesn't stop murders. But it kind of reduces it a little bit nah, to the way that these men were doing it. Was, yeah, these men were just killing, killing, kill, like, mm. they were just killing. And, mm. go on, sorry. There's men that do that, not Smart like that, though. but they are in positions of serious power. Mm. Back then, you could just be like, you know what, we got six men here, you know. If we go lick down a couple of men in the city, That's by fun. next week we have 18, man. Yeah. And, then rare t- and then it's before you know, it's just, you can't control what's going on. Yeah. You understand? So they're, especially, they're, if, go on, sorry, sorry, especially if the country don't even know that you're there. All, yeah, that's true. Like if you just move to the country, you're not yeah. registered. That's or nothing, what they were doing. That's what the man, man can just stop you in like bear man over, bear man over, yeah. and then them man are having children Along with, no with women that aren't registered as well. You just oh. got a back, you got a generation of people who are under the radar. Know, yeah, under the radar. That's bro. gangster. But they still obviously they had bear control in like they had like a union and that like these mafia bosses and that would have meetings Seriously. with each other. It's nuts. And then you had these rules where you can't kill a mafia boss. You can't, you can't, and any time you're going to duppy someone, you have to, the, the murder has to be commissioned. Yeah, so you've got to go to a man and say, you've got to go to your boss basically and say, look, like, I want to duppy X, Y, and Z for X, Y, and Z reasons. And they'll say, all right, cool. Or they'll say no. Mm. But at more time, they were the ones who were saying, yeah, this has got to go and whatnot. But that that was all rooted in like fucking um, uh, cement companies, oil, gas. They had bare different companies yeah. and shit like that. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. But these lot would literally sit around a dinner That's table, good. go to a steak place, eat steak, and be talking about, yeah, we've got a duppy this one, we've got to bring in my man. Like, just, bro, nah, literally, it meant bro. nothing. The way bro. the movies are, it's literally it's just like what it was. Bro. Yeah, yeah. And, no, and that with no DNA. My man got caught with 19 murders, but he basically alluded to the fact that, yeah, that's the, on the, that's the record. That's well, not what it was. Bro, do you have to? Do you know how much things there is? Remember, there's DNA, the thing that's getting all the youth them now, cell site. If something happens, you've got, you got your phone on you. So say something happens. Yeah. Say I leave the studio right now. I get into a mad thing with someone and someone ends up dying. They don't necessarily have to be me. Say I say, nah, I wasn't there. They'll take my phone. They, they'll take my cell site data. With these new... 3G, 4G, all of that. They could check where you've been all day. Mm. Even if you turned off everything. Now, if your phone's off, then... But then again... Now, I think they could still catch you if your I phone's can, off, you know? I can go in your settings right now and see where you've been for the last... Like, see? There you go. Cell site, bro. That's so how, how do you, I turn that off? think about it. These you, so, <laughs> what? You, you can't. So, I can't turn it off? You can't. But don't get interested. You ain't going to lick no one down. So no. Go. But at the same Nobody's time, think about it. The youth, them, they're walking around. <laughs> they got weapons on them. It's just anything could happen at any time. Mm. Something happens. They get away, they think they're in the clear. All they need is this, bro. That's why so Bear Man, you see Bear Man dashing their phone, right? Yeah. Or, they, or, or they try to leave their phone in a yard, isn't it? So, so say I get a little phone. £10 pound phone, then what? No. No. Are they, have they not got onto that one yet? If it's, if it's paid, you go. Yeah. What about the Encro thing? The Encro chats thing is like there. You got certain apps on. on that was the app, yeah, yeah. Uh, so it's still a smartphone. Yeah, thing. encrypted messages. So managers talking about. Oh, wait, wait, wait. pause this. Say again. Are on that as well, no? Yeah, pause but they've got rid of that pretty much now. No. On a contract line, I can be detected, but on a page you go, I can't. It's harder to. You harder. could don't get to if you like if someone let's 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 have it right. If someone's like dead, they'll do all they can. They're to gonna push you. out all the resources to find out w- w- through technology or whatever. But if it's like. A fight happened or something. Yeah. You might not even use your your, your good good Technology, smartphone. They probably yeah. just say fuck it. You understand? But cell site is getting man wrapped. I'm not gonna I'm lie. Gonna you see, when I look at the other side of it, yeah, I could see how it would be exciting for a police officer, for like like you know like the proper the higher ups that are looking for the higher ups because it's like mm. it's like the gang. It's like the the let's like look at the mafia for example, yeah. So you've got mafia bosses, mm. then you've got like the highest level sergeant or whatever. Yeah, like the lieutenant. Yeah, the guys, lieutenant. Yeah, and yeah. he knows that there's something going on and he's trying to crack this code. And by doing that now, you're testing people's loyalty. You know mm. what? Let me, like, come. If you put this wire on, I'll oh, make okay, sure yeah. that you get... And then, so you got this person who's put the wire on and then this person's in and around the mafia bosses. They're sitting there and listening to everything, piecing everything together. I can see how that is like a... 
like almost like a fun game for them. Mm. Especially oh. in the beginning, because if you have to remember, the first man that got done by wiretaps, they didn't know it existed, bro. Exactly. So they didn't know how to pat a man down. And exactly. Rip. So they're sat in an in a interview room hearing their own voice. They can't oh. believe it. How? How? You know them one? And they're thinking, nah, man, I've got a land road. I've got, I've got to tell the man them about this one. This is mad. Yeah, because they say, raw, like, there was a few men in that's there. Only a few. Bro, that's nuts when you that do is, that. Think about it, like first, that, you'd have mad. no idea, bro. No. Obviously, now... Tap pat man down, metal detect. There's all kind of shit that man could do to but check. But you would have denied everything, and the man would have played you. Would have denied you said, everything. And you what are you talking about? What? Yeah, my man. No, but hear this though. Hear this one though. Yeah, yeah. You can pat man down and all of that. But even still, to this day, say you're carrying on with a fuckery or whatnot now. Yeah. Mm. Then they've you're now being questioned about something and nice really on top for you and whatnot. Then it just transpires that they had something in your TV. Oh, you're done. Yes, in your mind. In your mind, you're thinking, how the fuck did they do that? Do you know what my mind can't get past? Say, for example, Lippy's driving, driving mm. somewhere. I'm like, oh, Lippy, drop me home. Mm. It's 12.30. We just were on the roads with a man there. Couple of we had a good vibe. I mm. want to go home now. Mm. I get dropped up at 12.30, but I leave my phone in his car. By 4 a.m., he's done a mad thing. I live by myself. No one even knows I was there. But by 4 a.m., a mad thing's happened. Lippy's ducked out, but he's still got my phone. By 10 a.m., I collect my phone off him the next day. Oh, no fucked. one knows that no, I... Do you know why you're not fucked? Because you could get away with it without snitching. You could say, they dropped me home at this time. Right. And you say, when? Oh. And you got my car story. was at the property at this time. Right. I then left my phone. That's why you come back the next day. So you you can say, that's you proving I can't snitch on my brethren because I wasn't with him and I wasn't there. And you didn't even know. Yeah, it's like that. You have that's you proving your soul. If anything, <laughs> if your brethren then said though, he's like, we were all got... together all night. The phone was in the car. You're fucked, right? Because no, be this way, your brethren's not gonna turn around and go, "He's lying. He was with me." Because then he's incriminating himself. Right. Uh, you get me. So, right. Uh, but where you would be fucked though is if a man sat in the car with you and said, "Yeah, I'm listen. Hey, what I'm bouncing, but I'm gonna go and lick down my man. But when, when I'm on my way home, yeah. I'm just letting you know that." Mm. So now. You know, you, you're privy to this information. You haven't done anything to stop it. Exactly. So if you if now they catch you on that, then you're fucked. Yeah. Because yeah. some, you some people will stupidly admit that. They'll be like, look, my man told me he was going to lick my man down. Then you're fucked. That's why I got, the car, that's why I got out of the car so fast and forgot my phone. Then they're going to say, hold on. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> you knew he was going to lick my Yeah, they're going to say, why? You didn't report that. Why so you, you just got to be like, I left my phone in that car. Did you know what they went to do? No comment. No comment. No, no comment. comment. When did you go yeah. to get your phone? 10 a.m. So the no good. comment part could fuck you. It though. will, but at the same time, you're, you're say you go all the way to court. Well, I said, Lippy, you're mm-hmm. telling one part of it and not... No, because... That's we, where the game is. No, you have to no comment if everything. It, nah, but it... it, it can, nah, no, but I wouldn't. Nah, that's you why can't, because pay it this way. Because if... Because remember, your solicitor... Yeah. If your solicitor says, don't say nothing, because pay it this way. Don't ask me how I know this. In that in that situation, yeah. Again. yeah, your your solicitor would have a pre-prepared statement. You know, comment everything. Everything your solicitor says is all the information they need. Mm. My man left his car, phone in the car. They went off and done whatever. We didn't know they cut. They did this till you nicked him. How about that? So he has no preparation to say nothing. That's how his phone was in the car. That's it. He's gonna give no comment from now. They'll say okay, thank you. Then they'll sit there and ask you the maddest of questions. Some of the questions will be so simple. Like you said, there's the game. They'll be like, okay then, so what time? No comment, no comment, no comment. So what time did you get the phone again? 10 a.m. Oh, yeah, yeah, then yeah. the next question they'll ask is, why did you just no comment every other question? You can say no comment, because you're in a maze now, Yeah. You, you're thinking. So even if you think and then say no comment, they can stand you up in court and be like, yeah, my man said no comment and that, but he was thinking though. Yeah, yeah. He was thinking. And then you're like, rah. But, but I feel if, as well, if you mad. answer, if they turn around and said, oh, look, you, you're you a cold-blooded murderer, ain't you? And then you turn around and say, after all these no comments, you turn around and say, I'm not. Yeah, no, I'm not. Then, Dave, you, so you, yeah, so what cracked. do you know then? Why yeah. are you no commenting everything? In it. But now we've got in you it. to this part and you're saying in no it. then. This is what you I would know say. Something. This is what yeah. I would say. I would simply say, sorry, sir. Basically, my father told me from when I was younger, when you take a picture, make sure you can interpret it in one way. 
Your question, however I answer it, you can dissect it and make it something else. But you see closed questions you ask me, are you happy? Yes, I'll answer that. But any question where it potentially can take me somewhere else with my answer, mm. I'd rather not be involved. Now, don't get twisted. They know that. So whatever. That's even, what I'm trying to say. You, it's a so game. You, don't so get like, you go to uh, court, I'm they'll put you through the whole thing, cross-examine you, and they'll be like, yeah, nothing's happened. But, bro, that process, that... You don't want to be that guy, bro. Especially, because you know what it is? Let's have it right. There's a lot of men in that situation that get in a jam and they're like, I don't know. Like, you know, you see it in the movies where yeah. the, the detective has the light on them. Tell us, you know, every... And they lidge don't know. Because you're not even thinking, no comment. No, you're thinking, I'm telling the truth, bro. I I, I don't know. What's going on? There's like, they, I don't know. What's, what's happening? You tell I me. Know. You know, man. Stop acting like you don't know. They're on and that. They're like, brother, I promise I you, know. I don't care. <laughs> they're on that. Yeah, they're on that. Yeah. They're like, so you don't know this girl? These times you've never seen the girl. But here now where you're in the pickle. You know what? If you're not going to tell it, you're the one. It's not me that's going to serve the 50 years. Yeah, it's not me. That. It's not me. I They're on to, that. I, yeah, I, don't, I get to go home with my family. Have you They're seen really that? on that. Seen that when What's they, the bitch? See that when they see us. Yeah. When they see us. On oh Netflix. my yeah. God. Oh, bro. bro, none of these youths. Bro, they had men on the case that hadn't even seen each other before. Give give the context for people. Yeah, so basically. I've seen, the, that. I've seen that. I've seen that. You know what is it's the, yeah. was it the Central Park Five? Yeah. It's five of them, five yeah. teenage boys. Yeah. Some of them was quite young. One of them was like yeah. 12, yeah. 13. He was the one who ended up doing yeah, the most. Yeah, doing time. the most. And one of them was like late teens. So they've they've got this. Some woman's been raped in Central Park in New York. Um, one of them wasn't even there at the time. Yeah, one, one of them, shot yeah, yeah, one of them was not up. there yeah. at all. But four of them were in the park in this current time. So off all of them, including the fifth one, admitting that they were in the park at a certain time, they got nicked. Because they coerced them. to. Because first, they never arrested them. First, they kind of just said, you know what? You was in the park. Something happened while you was in the park. Do you mind being questioned about it? And obviously, as an innocent you, especially if you hear someone's passed away, you're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to... I say everything that I saw. Yeah. You know them ones? Mm. But then they got them in and they started kind of playing... Not even kind of. They started playing them against the, each other. 100%. And remember, say it's you and me, poet. We're dogs. Say they come in and said, rah, poet said you did it. I know, poet, man. You're trying it. They say, if you're some guy I've never met before, you're like, what? Then they'll kawa- they'll kawalis you to think, you know what? My man might be saying you did it because he did it. Yeah. Do you think he did it? And you're like, you know what? You might it might be right, you know, because I don't know my man from nowhere. So how, how's he saying it's me? Yeah. Like, he's covering something. He did it. Yeah, he must have done it. Then you're like, but hold on. You said you don't know him. So why are you saying he done it now? You, ju- you said you didn't know anything. But well, they're I like, know him. you know them ones, but you're like, <laughs> but he's, he's from my... You said he's older, right? Older men kill people. I'm just 12. I don't... You know them ones? Yeah. But hold on. When we asked you in the beginning, bro, you you know anything, you said no. So why do you know something now? Now you're wrapped. Now, as a child, you feel you have to answer. And they even went as far as to say, you know what? If you say you did it, you're going to get four years. Right. And then you're like, but I didn't do anything, though. He's like, brother, if you don't say you did it, you're going to get life, bro. Yes, four years is better. Oh, bro, do you know how much people in America are getting fucked with this? Exactly. This day, then they're like, and you're a child. So you're just like, you know what? Uh, it was, it was, oh, did you do it? And then they're like, you know what? Don't say it was you. Just say it was your friend and you saw it and read, you'll get four years. Yeah, yeah. They'll stand you up in court. Yeah, yeah, I did it. You're the what? About 30 you, something years. You missed huh? the part as well, actually. Yeah, it's when the, the officers, now he realizes that you're, that you're about to fold. They'll say, this is how they get you now. They'll say, so look, just tell us about the time when he took the knife out. Just tell us about that. So they will just jump all the way. And then then it's like, you know, then just tell us about when, you know, when, you know, you put her on the ground and like, tell us, tell us why, tell us why the cap was there. And they were making, but but, but because of the convos they've had off out of the interview room, they're just making shit up in their head. It's like, my man's looking them directly in the eye. So tell us what happened. When she was on the floor. I know you didn't put her on the floor, but tell us what happened. My man didn't even floor. know she was on These the floor. These times you don't know nothing about no floor. Uh, oh. It was cold. Like, you just you just say something that you think is open. Like, mm. you know, them, oh, it was windy. It was dark. I couldn't see. So how did you know she was on the floor? Why uh, did he, why did he, tell us about the type, why did he put the blouse on the bench? All of that. Blouse yeah. and skirt. All of that. I bitch. didn't even know there was a blouse on the bench. But now... You know what, yeah, thing, you just, you get what I'm saying? Boy, Do you know what I wish? I wish I was in a situation like that with this mentality. Nah, then I would look right. at them no, you're and right. just you're go, right. You're right. oh, so what was you doing this night? Oh, but they knew what they was doing, bro. Because yeah. wasn't there. Because when you look at that story, like the true story of that, there was little road youths in the park as well. Yeah. Yeah. But they knew we can't grab them. They're savvy. These men go jail and rip. They'll just sit there laughing in the interview room like, yeah, <laughs> no comment. 
<laughs> no comment, no comment, no comment. So it's like, even if it was them, they're just gonna get, oh, they're just gonna get away with it. They're too, but they're the street youths, smart. But these youths, we can rope them in, make them the new criminals. We know they know nothing about anything. They don't even know each other. Do we have plea bargains in this country? Yes. Yeah. We do, yeah? Yeah. Is it so just different plea because bargain. of that? So basically, if you, see before, it, it's like not taking it to trial and just saying you're guilty, basically. But so after if you say you've gone if, after you've gone not guilty. Though. After you've gone not guilty. So say so you go not right. guilty, yeah. they'll come to you before the trial and they'll be like, look, this it's looking mad. You know what I'm saying, bro? Like you could do this not guilty thing, but you're most likely to lose and you're gonna get 80. Based years. upon the evidence yeah, that they've got. got. But hear what I'm saying? Go guilty plea now and you'll get eight years. And you know what? I might even be able to negotiate that. Exactly. And, and half of the time they do do you see, brother, perfect. Yesterday. The first ever, they do it like yeah. America now. The yeah. first ever court case was yeah. televised. He killed his grandson. Yeah, he killed in his, England. In England, it's they're now doing it now. They're allowed to televise sentencing, yeah. and they and they they're gonna it's gonna be more than sentencing soon. But now they're and the case that it was an autistic boy, he he'd already done family. time in jail for sex abuse on a child, but he was molested himself by his granddad. He's now up for killing the granddad. But the circumstances surrounding this is crazy. So it's like... What did he get? He got... I've watched the whole thing, yeah? It started at... He got 24 years. I'm surprised. He, he got... No, he got 24 years, but he's eligible for parole at 10 years. Wow, okay. Yeah, to two So he got 24 like years for killing the man that sexually abused him. Yeah, but the reason... No, but, but, but the when you saw the... Royal the, family. No, nah, but hear this. No, nah, hear this. When you saw the judge's breakdown, I can't even lie, it made sense. Because they were like... She was like, um, I have to take into the account that like you have a social disability. So you're... And the fact that something has happened to you when you were younger. Yeah. So your ability to know right from wrong... Is different. In certain situations, yeah, yeah. is different. Yeah. But they're saying, but the nature of when you how you killed your granddad, you knew what you were doing. Right. Yeah, because he's... He said st- stuff like, he sat in the interview room saying, I stabbed my granddad in his eyes so he couldn't see me. I stabbed him in his yeah, mouth yeah. so he couldn't shout. I, I, I juked him in his throat I knew he would kill him straight away. And, re- and it, he's answering clear. So if no matter what you've done, if you sit in a police interview room and just tell the truth, it works in your favour. No, yeah, no matter what. what. Yeah, no yeah. matter what. Yeah. If you sit there and be like, yeah, you know what? I did do that. Yeah, that, that happened. Yeah, 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 You understand? But with him, the judge is like, you, because of your condition, mm. that might have been the reason you've given us all this detail in it. In the so first now, place. Because it, it might, because again, the the prime reason why they say you tell the truth in the, in the court of law is remorse. Yeah. But they're saying, but because of your disability, not it might, not, it might no. not necessarily be remorse. You're just confused to the extent that you don't even understand what you've done is wrong. And he probably might not even understand the severity in that what could happen punishment wise yeah as well. he doesn't bro for one he's been he's, he went to jail before for abusing a child got mash up in there yeah he's come out what when he's come out one of his other siblings or his mum or something has been arrested for trying to kill the same granddad when the police have come and got him he's sitting with his grandma his grandma's told the feds we all wanted him dead yeah so it's like it's, it's, it's oh well, they're, yeah no they're, the bro, they're moving they're, like his family is battling for him like it's happened. He's cooperated. They're basically trying to say what what his family is trying to go on the, the they're going down the lane of if you stop the granddad from early, none of this shit would have happened in the first it? place. But, yeah, but from the gra- from the granddad was on fuckery. Granddad's molested bare of them. But you do, know, do you know why they couldn't? Do you know why he couldn't bust case on that? Yeah, he couldn't. It's because it opens up a can of worms. But then. he got because he got. Do you know why he got um t- two thirds though? What she she reduced it from murder to manslaughter. Because they said, all this, fair enough, stabbing man in the eyes and that. It, you knew what you were doing, but that makes no did sense. Did he go there to do it? Because if he, he went there to do it, did. that's murder still. He did, he did. But it's the, it's the whole... That's first degree. I'm not going to lie. Is, there's, there's... If, you, if I come there with the big four or mm. five, with the, with the mentality of, you know what, today's the day... I'm going there with I the mentality of anger. I, I hear that, but pushing Laura aside, fam, and maybe I shouldn't even say things this year. Molesting granddad. Fam, man will slice nah, your neck. No, bro, fam, there's... Fuck yeah, that. Nah, there's, there's I can't think right. of say that you're a male- Like, there's no way I care about everything else after. You're the senior guy in the family and you're out here playing with it. Yeah, nah, and it... it, it, it Do you know what it does, fam. though? Do you know what that does, though, yeah? 
Because exactly. I'm with you on that. I but all it does is, it just opens up the kind of worms now where if you bust case on that, then bare man are just going to get lit down. No, let's have the... it right. Did you juke up my granddad? Why did you juke him up? Yeah, he molested him. Yeah, molested Yeah, that's it. These time, granddad didn't do nothing, you know. <laughs> Charlie just watched the, the news thing the other day thinking, I can kill granddad. Well, yeah, I can, but I can... I can what? mash him up. You know what? Let that. me go and get granny as well. Then. Yeah. Do you, you know, know what, that, though? That? I hear where you're coming from, but depending on the country and your status within that country, that determines your sentence. What do you mean? So, depending on the country, there are certain countries where everyone can do fuckery. Everyone can do fuckery. It's open to everybody. Where? You can do fuckery. Certain mm. places in fucking, like, the Balkan area. Because you can pay the police. The president can pay I the police. You, everybody you. can pay the police. So we're good. Mm. But there are certain countries where you can't pay the police. You can be in the royal family, trouble kids, and nothing happens apart from you're sweating live on TV. But if you mm-hmm. are mm. the man in the council estate, you are 100 percent go in prison so i believe and i understand where you're coming from but only to a certain extent only to a certain extent do you know what i think you can always pay someone even if you even even if if it's not directly with money you can always bribe someone to do some shit but that's what i'm trying to say to you in another country bro like when i take a look at i listen to what and say for example andrew tate was saying and i kind of understood that if i'm in a country where we can all do fuckery it's an even playing field Mm. So that's where I say your point does stand. Mm. But if I'm in a country where I can't do fuckery, but if you if if I shoot someone today, I go prison. But if the police shoot someone, they're fucking going home having sex with their missus. It's just like it's that that really point doesn't. That. It's not even. Well, the fair. police is a part of the game in that as well, isn't it? Like, the police are a part of the game too because ultimately they're a pawn in the, it, they're they're a pawn that's in this, mad. and they're the ones that even going back to what I was saying with the mafia, enough of them end up because they know that these men are the little man. Those you can bribe them, they're easy to bribe. They're mm. easy to bribe. Mm. If you get someone in the higher office now, then you're fucking more certified. So yeah, that, uh, these that were fucking bribing um, uh, uh, people in the court. They were doing a whole load of that stuff. You get what I'm saying? If you have the the ability to be able to do that, then you're up. But there'll always be someone. There will always be someone that will be trying to play the game mm. against them. Maybe not for the greater good of society, uh, just because of the adrenaline rush that you get within doing that. Because they could be just as wicked. Because you know what? See, sorry to go. I feel like we're going a little bit left. You know, I have the I'm capacity not. to do that. But you see, laws. Mm. Laws are things I just can't. I understand their purpose, but they're made by someone for a particular reason mm. that never is representative of what's going on. Mm. So there, I'm just like, if you break the law. All you're doing, sometimes, not all the time, you're just pissing off someone that said you shouldn't do that. Yeah, some laws. Let's have it right. Do you know what I'm coming from? Like, because yeah. the laws just don't make no sense. So it's just like, yeah. you know, I might have to move What's to the What's the solution for that, though? There is no solution. I don't think there is. There is no solution. Do you know what it is? It's just, I think we're just lucky that a lot of these laws are within morals, in it. Don't kill, don't steal, don't. You understand? You'll get in trouble for things that. Morally, yeah, I even if there was right. no law, you'd know these things were wrong, innit? Right. You understand? So it's kind of like... It's just when it starts to get into yeah, the when nuance it's, and start, you start It's not even up. that. It's yeah. just the loopholes within it because life is not black and white for you to go, you shouldn't do this. You Thou should not steal. Well, guess what, geezer? The amount of money I make with the living conditions that I'm in mean that at the end of the month, I have £10 to play with and I have two picnics. So if you're something. telling me thou shall not steal yeah, under I'm, them I'm, conditions, if, if my, where's the yeah. moral high ground there? I'm, my kids mm, cannot mm, eat. Mm, and I'm not meant to steal. And I'm not saying stealing is right or wrong. What I'm saying is the way they make the country, for you to make black and white decisions, that's just unfair. Because mm. the black and white decisions are always going to favour the people that are the most privileged. The people that are not privileged, which are half the people that do the fuckery in the first place. But the law, I'm but from? I hear that. But the laws ain't always based off just the black and white. Because what you're saying is, yeah, mm. and what we all agree on is that, like, the 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 root essentially is based off some form of moral yeah mm. and then you have to then start opening up what that actually looks like yeah. when you start opening that up that's where there's loopholes yeah because there's so many different huh there's so many different variables there's so many different aspects to it it's like you open it up more and more and more people will always still find the loophole but ultimately I agree with you but you got it the wrong way around so it's like the fuckery's happened first and then the rules have happened. That's why there's no solution. If we make a building right now and we create rules and we're all cool with it, mm-hmm. that's the rules forever. 
Now this building of what? Huh? How do you know that though? Well, all right. Well, you would have a better fair chance. You say we've just made the building. These are the rules. Calm. But there was fuckery before this building of England was made. There was bare fuckery. Yeah. So they made the rules based upon the fuckery. Right. That's why yeah, I agree I with Lippy that. that there's that. no solution. But because you have to you, bypass sometimes all the Sometimes it has fuckery. to be fuckery for rules, though. Oh no! Now because that's how we started. So we yeah, have to have fuckery. Like, yeah, we never you, started. You, you fuckery. don't know. You don't know. Cool. If you if there isn't the fuckery, then you don't know that yeah. the ability is there. Yeah. So then you make the law in that, and that's why laws always still get changed or put in because there's. What was the thing that happened that happened? Oh, so like, did you watch Our Father, the documentary, yeah? I haven't watched we it We talked yet. about it a little uh, bit, yeah, but you it, know, like, it. so basically, do you know do you know what that is? Basically, L- the man listen worked to in- Listen this fuckery. The man worked in a sperm donor. You oh, yes, I know so you what you're know, talking about. Right. I know yeah, what you're yeah, talking yeah. about. But do you know, do you 200 know? 200 pick me or something. Brother. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They're willing, they, thought, on record is 94, but there's probably way more than that, yeah? On record, there's 94. On record, it's 94. But you know, like, you got to think of how many that hasn't come through. Yeah. And then you got to think of, like, how many didn't work. You know yeah, what I'm bro. saying? Exactly. But do you know, yeah, that he couldn't, they couldn't put him in jail for it because there wasn't a law yeah, for yeah. it. So and they couldn't make the it a law. They now, so because now, the because he's done that, before, they can make a law yeah. for that. But he's... No, but he bust, but he bust, but he's he's bust it. He's busted. He's done it before the law. Sorry to get too deep, but the the fuckery before that is the fact that that's a white man in a country that doesn't belong to him that his claim belongs to him. So off the back of that, fuckery I run. He can do anything. Fuckery I run. We've got mm-hmm. stolen land because <laughs> we're going to steal some picnic. <laughs> this is stolen land. So that's what I'm trying to say to you. All the fuckery has happened before. That's why moving forward, your whole thinking is fuckery. So most of the laws you're going to make are not going to be based nah, on... Nah, but it's like, I appear this way, yeah? Fuckery. I appear this way, yeah? Mm-hmm. As man seen, is a book, there's a book, there's a mo- I seen the movie. Has man heard of the movie, Lord of the Flies? No, Heard no. of Lord of the Flies? Heard of Lord of the Flies? So Lord of the Flies, yeah, like that, is about... I think it's set in World War One, World War Two. There's a plane full of people getting evacuated from... In, in, the, in the book is England in the, in the movie it's America so they're getting evacuated from America you know like kids used to do in the war and that but mm. then the plane gets licked down and Shit. bare people die on the plane but the only survivors are little boys between the age of 12 and no I tell a lie between the age of like 6 and 12 they're the Lit. only survivors in it so naturally the 12 year old boys the older ones they're, they're like the leaders in it and they set Certain rules in it, like the older boys will hunt, the younger boys will, um, they always have to keep a fire for a smoke signal just in case planes are coming by and they like allocate rules to people. But as they, as time goes on, they make more rules because problems mm. yeah, emerge yeah, yeah, yeah. that they didn't mm. know about. You know what I mean? So one of the main problems that happens is two of the younger boys wonder, oh, no, a plane crashes, yeah, they, but they see... The, the pilot eject from the thing before the missile hits it. So they think, my man's alive. He's here to save us. They're kids, you know them one. But, so they go off to find the, the, the soldier, but the youths that find him, they're young. They're like six. And they think it's a monster. Because already they've told, they've convinced themselves there's a monster on the island. So we all need to stick together. So two boys have wandered off. They've seen the, da- the, the pilot's dead body mangled in the trees and obviously they're kids so they just see it one glance sprint back i've seen the monster i've seen the monster it's real in it yeah so they're like cool we need to practice how to kill this monster yeah they decide that yeah while they're practicing killing the monster one of the older youths is like i don't believe in monsters bro there's no way there's a monster so he goes off with like a glow stick thing because they got like supplies so he goes off with a glow stick to go see it and he puts a glow stick against the thing and he sees it's a man. It's a dead body. But he's tight, because obviously it's in the middle of the night and he's a glow stick. So he's sprinting back towards his all the little boys and there's bare of them, like 30, 40 youths. And he's screaming, yo, yo, it's not real, it's not real. But he runs back as they're doing this practicing of the killing of the monster. So they all got like sharpening their spears and shit. And they see a glow stick waving towards them oh, so in a beach. Smoke. So they're like, that, that's the real monster. So they're scared. What do you think they do? They, they chop him to pieces, yeah, bro. Yeah. And they chop him to pieces so badly that they don't even recognise that it's a person. So the older boys who know it's a person, they're like, yeah, we killed the real monster, innit? So obviously they clock. There's a problem now. None of us know what we're doing, innit? So then they make new rules. I think it's, you can't wander off 
Okay. Unless you know, or you understand, but right. you wouldn't even think, you wouldn't think, rah, let me make this rule just in case we kill each other. Yeah. And from they realize they can kill, they could, they go into a frenzy. They set off into two different tribes. Oh, they yeah. start warring each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They start kidnapping each other from the tribe. They're killing each other. And then at the end... This sounds like some real life. Bro, it's crazy, bro. It's, 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 it's a proper... What's it stick, called? Bro. Lord of the Flies. And okay. imagine the reason it's called Lord of the, Lord of the Flies is because they go hunting and they get a pig and they do an offer, like a sacrifice to the monster. So they put the pig's head on a stick and they leave it there. But obviously, because they're all there, no food, no water, they're all hallucinating. So a youth's walking one day and he don't know about this sacrifice shit. He's just seen a pig's head on a stick with bare flies surrounding it. And he starts hallucinating and the, the head starts speaking to him and says, I'm the Lord of the Flies. Man. You need to go do this. Man. You need to do that. The beast isn't a real thing. The beast is inside of you. You can't kill it. All of these things. But this youth's just going through all this fuck you. You understand? So it's like, like man said before, yeah, some rules will be set out just because of human nature, innit? But until problems happen, bro, you can't make it. It's like fuckery has to happen. So what did I say to you at the start? Just to do the whole thing. What happened at the start of this story? What the... What happened at the start yes. of the story? War. There was yeah. a fuckery. Yeah. So when fuckery starts, the rules mm. you make is based on fuckery. Mm. That's what I'm trying to say to you. Like, if we made a building, yeah, no but that's fuckery. Not, but that's not a bad thing, though. Mm. Of course I'm not saying it's a bad thing. But oh. unfortunately, that means there's no solution. Rules exist because of fuckery. Well, no, no. What do you mean? There's no. Or, remember, for example, we were talking about the solutions to certain problems and things, and we spoke about society, and I said there'd be mm-hmm. no solution because the whole thing started on fuckery. And then the rules that were created weren't to counter the fuckery, it was more or less part of the fuckery. And then you keep changing the rules all the well, time. Isn't, because the, more, isn't the law supposed to stop the fuckery? But it is, know, but it it's not. Certain, but it even in Lord it does protect. I know. Yeah, because yeah, it doesn't. Because even in Lord of the Flyers, yeah, there's certain rules that they have that will affect the young youths. But the older youths, it don't, it don't really affect them. So imagine this. Imagine I'm making rules for all of us, but I'm a part of all of us. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah. This doesn't, like, it's ne- um, there's always going to be a rule to favour me. Come right. on, guys. So I'm saying to you, if it's made of fuckery, there is no solution. All you're doing is passing down this normality to another group of people that go, well, this is all I've ever done. And then yeah, you pass it to I someone think, else. I, I hear that in, in the sense of, I like, don't think it solves. you see, like, the laws in when you look at like tax for example and stuff mm-hmm. like that like those things yeah there's going to be people that are disadvantaged in that yeah and people that are going to be massively advantaged because obviously there's money in line or whatever but when, when we're talking about like the I, I guess this is what we're probably all agreeing on the moral aspect moral, of it like yeah. the life yeah. if i come in and i say you know what we've got this place here no one can kill each other mm. I guess you could probably say that that favours me because maybe you might have wanted to kill me and I'm made a law now you to know stop it from doing that. It always comes from but some kind of it's mad start, place. There you go, fuckery. I'm just, obviously, what I'm asking for is an impossible task because it's not possible. That's why I said to you, it's impossible for these things to change. They are built of fuckery and every single transition is a new thing to say, how do we prevent more fuckery? Before you know it, we're here. Well, fuckery is rooted in man. Mm, it is, it is. <laughs> Listen, you know... Like, it's documented about, you know, the, the blood that America has on their hand and whatnot, yeah. But sometimes we might need to just keep it 100 about some of the blood that's in Africa. Bro. I'm telling you now. Bro. Like, it's some of the things that, like, some of the things that the tribes and that, some tribes, do to each other. Some of the things that the, they practice on each other and whatnot. Like, these rituals that they've had for thousands and thousands and hundreds of thousands of years that they're doing to people is crazy. Listen, but, but, don't compare it to America. But, because whatever fuckery happens No, there, no, no, I'm not, I'm not comparing it. I'm just saying fuckery is yeah, fuckery. fuckery is fuckery. Fuckery is just fuckery. I can still look nah, at something and say... Nah, fuckery is not fuckery. Of course it is. Nah, it is, because pretty listen, in... There's scales to fuckery. Nah, there is. Yeah, of course. There's, yeah, there's, yeah, there's, there's a tribe in... I think it's East Africa. Female, mi- do you know what? Yeah, female yeah. mutilization is fuckery. Yeah, that's fuckery. What? I don't even, I don't female, care what female, what scale we put that in. Mu- that is fuckery. Female genital oh, mutilation. Yeah, that is that's fuckery. fuckery. That's a fuckery. fuckery. But do you know what yeah, to me is more nuts. fuckery? What's always going to be more fuckery than anything. Mm. Me doing fuckery here, mm-hmm. going doing fuckery over there, and encouraging you to think this isn't fuckery. Now we've got two places of fuckery. Mm. If this is one place of fuckery, we've got one place to deal with all the mess. So when I think about America, I think about a bag of Europeans that are doing fuckery in Europe, move to the Americas, kill all of them, do a fuckery there, and then try and do fuckery around the world. 
There is no... There's nothing for me even to mention in the same breath. Is that me saying Messi? We just stop after that. No, there's fuckery is fuckery. Mm. Fair enough. I just disagree, man. Fuckery is fuckery. We, I think we get to a point in life as well where we can... I mean, maybe I'm talking from a point of privilege, but like, you know, even when it look when you look at some of the things that happen to young children in whatever country, it's like, fucked. It's mental. It's fucked. But, but some so, of the things, but some, some, of, of, some of the things that are happening to young children are are used as justification for either religion or tradition or culture or whatever it is, and it's like, you know what? At one point, people just did not know better, and that just what was what it was. And you know what? Maybe. Maybe in them in them times, all it took was for one person to just convince a group of people, wherever it was in the country, that mm. this is actually fine. And it just mm. passed on and passed on and passed on and passed on. Mm. But sometimes when you take a step back and you look and you say, all right, irrespective of all of that, like that's just a bit mad though. Yeah. Like it's just yeah. a bit mad. Mm. But there's no solution in that because we are never, ever, ever in life going to live in harmony, ever. Never. Ever. ever. It's too much. Levels. This is never yeah. going to happen. Yeah. Like when you said the um, things are there to stop crime and police. And... Cause it's not, man. It's a, I always it's a game. That, it's a game. Sat down one the whole time thing said, is a game. The yeah. court is a game. The, the, everything is a game. Court, so for one second, me, me and my dad sat down and we said, imagine there was no crime. Do you know how much unemployed people there are if there's no crime? That's not no a life man out of job. No life without crime. I ain't no, even got top wear. I can't no. even watch top wear. There's nothing like, they're, they're, like street fire. It's unimaginable. Like, yeah, it's unimaginable. You it's can't like, even play football without crime. But there's no good about evil. Yeah, that's exactly. What it is. That's what it is. And that's no what I'm saying. That's not what God said because he. Nah, it is. But out. literally, just the, the balance of energy. <laughs> there's like, good like up we there said before. With no evil, there can't be rules without fuckery. But that's only because of man. That's because of man. That's why I say. If I understand that man is responsible for fuckery, it's like, raw. But sometimes the law's not the bad thing. It's just the man. Yeah, yeah. Like, the idea is not bad. The yeah. idea is actually all right. Yeah. It's us. And it I is. think sometimes it's not. I think it's not us, bro. Sometimes the idea that you're presenting to a group of people that you've poisoned, it's like... I've given you McDonald's for 50 years of your life and I'll say to you, hey, we should start eating healthy. But it's who like, poisoned what the them? Hell, but who bro? poisoned them? Mm. Man. Yeah. What man? But we won't go there Even today. Whether it's I'm not better, you, it's I'm still better. us. Like, no, no. you can't, you get me, bro. Like, it's, you only, uh, it's mad, isn't it? Because it's like. Remember, I'm talking from a working class perspective. Go on. Mm. So go. a working class perspective, I'm never going to be, I'm more of the victim. You're more of the victim. You're more of the victim. Are we? The perp- of course we are. Nah, do you know what it is? But there's a hierarchy of power, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you know we have to one. keep it going. <laughs> <laughs> go on, go on, it's just like, it's just there's a there's a hierarchy of power like in in all aspects of life you understand yeah. so even if you used to get an alley full of homeless people there's a main tramp in there yeah. you understand yeah, 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 we're main homeless person no let's go yeah. I know yeah. it's fuck. Let's I know no I hear there's you a, no, I hear you. you get me whether whether he's got the the most gums or he's the toughest or the who knows but for a reason well, when it's time that, to rise yeah, up it'll rise up human nature in it you yeah. you. You get me? Whether it, whether you put a man there or he puts himself there, the hierarchy of power. Well, that man said, "Lord of the Flies, bro." Six to twelve-year-olds, bro. These are the purest souls on earth, bro. They see a what? man running down. Yeah, you been to my, you been to my primary school. Yeah, but bro, they're it's pure. Youth. They, they don't, they don't know anything. Come yeah. on, bro. They're being evacu- evacuated from a war. They still chop up their bridging with sticks. You understand? Because mm. it's when you separate everyone. Like, put it this way, perfect example, yeah? Like you said, we're the working class, innit? Mm. We know the baddies of our community, innit? The, mm. the, the bad guys, if you want to call them, bro. Mm. I never put them there. They didn't necessarily put them there. It just happened, bro. Whether it it's didn't road just happen, man, but Whether but it's we, road we man. Yeah, you get me? Whether it's road man, the baddest you on your block, the red. It just happens, bro. These things just, it's just human nature. It's learned from the top. Mm. Don't get it twisted for, from the government, royal family, all of this, but it's just, it's human nature, bro. I think anything from nature just happens, but anything like that mm. is not coincidence. And it's not coincidence that all Jamaicans have moved to a certain part of London, or it's not coincidence that all, do you know, these things are not coincidence. And then when you have that group of individuals, they're strong now, and then they're in wider society, and then they start doing things that, because they're comfortable. Mm. They do things in their environment, just second nature because of what comes to them. But then outside of that community, it's deemed as weird or whatever. Then we're gonna have problems because now we have differences. We don't respect differences. We don't educate ourselves in them. We just war. 
just like for example you spoke about the lord of the flies mm. no one looked at their differences and said let's make rules and regulations based upon our differences so there's understanding because mm. they don't even understand themselves yeah, so it's, it's all based kids. upon fear yeah. all of these other yeah. things do you know where i'm coming from yeah, and then I think, you make a law based off that what's that and they yeah. make look but it's laws based off fuckery mm. it's not love it's nothing to do with love so more you put all of these restrictions and it's based upon some fuckery i just think for fuckery to happen afterwards it makes perfect sense to me but when you start making things... Do you even, need law based on love? It would be nice, but it just can't happen. It's it too idealistic. No if, 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 you made, if you made the law based on love, don't you limit the love? You're yeah. supposed to limit fuckery, yeah. really. But you would limit love if you made the law based upon love, right? Mm. You can't do that right now. One child you policy. Can't do it. Can't do yeah, yeah, yeah. One child policy. Yeah. That's nuts. That's you can't five. make a... You yeah, can't like now I, that's a law based upon love, isn't it? It's like, yeah. all right, cool. Me and you are together, but now we can only... We can only have one. Yeah, we can only have one now. X, y, why, is that, why is that a law based on love? That's not, that's not, not based, a law based, that's based on, on love. fuckery. That's oppression, bro. That's oppression, yeah. That's not mm. based on love. So, yeah, that's what I'm saying. If there was a law based upon love, you're limiting love. It can't you're be a law based limit. on love. Because what, what you... What would a, a law based on love mean? You I have to love like. your, You have to love your youth. No, nothing like that. I'm well, not, quick, I'm on, not quite sure. I'm a, listen, it is the, what's today, the 29th of July? Uh-huh. On a, I don't have the answer right now. But I do know if I do something based and purely from fuckery, I don't expect... No, but pretty this way, rules, pretty this way. This, this will make everyone understand. But I understand. Rule, rules. Do you know how rules come from fuckery? Mm. Yeah? Do you, have you heard how football was before all the rules? You know what the first game of football was? Uh, there's two villages against each other. Yeah. They put a ball in the middle. The nice. way you won was to get your ball across to the other village. That's the only rule. But people are dying, bro. <laughs> youths, youths, chil- <laughs> youths, children are yeah. getting kicked and ripped. Then they're thinking, hold on. This is mine. Let's, okay, make, Let's, the, make right. the pitch smaller. Right. Then they made the pitch smaller. They realised everyone's getting killed just in a small space now. It's like, okay, then no killing. No fouling. Yellow card, red card. Now Kids, only red t- and now before we have this right. beautiful game, but without all this fuckery, you I will still be that. in the village. EA, I'm racist. Who am I gonna say? What am I gonna say now? Who started that game? Who? No, but come on, bro. Look at the. And did they ever stop killing? They're still killing now. So like, I'm saying to you, we I can go. You, we can go to, them, but I can go to some <laughs> rules <laughs> with black people. It's just not this type but of thing. But the sentiment of what you're saying, hundred percent. I understand yeah, where yeah. it's coming from, but again. It's just even in the most positive and team. them group of white people who's no, 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 not being racist no. are full of fuckery so everything they make is a birth of fuckery I don't expect perfection yeah but it's us it's too fuckery. Yes, it it's us, us too if you think black people have never done anything <laughs> no wrong, it's mad it's I'm not saying that but I know, you know that what it is, we, I, I, cool, put it this way why no. am I in Tottenham because of black people why are you in wherever you in because of black people nah, I hear you, but why are you where you are because of black people we yeah. make the best of a bad situation. No, but essentially, I should be in the sun getting a tan all year round. I'm not. Hear what I'm so, saying. Let me, let me, wait, put, I know, wait, but wait, imagine wait, I've been placed wait, here. Wait, one second, Come on, wait. man. I hear you. You know It's me. just, that's one aspect of yeah. so many different yeah. aspects of but life. But we were though. speaking about the start. The we're just talking about why. laws and rules. Yeah. No, but I was talking about, again, the And that's why. universal. A hundred percent. But we were saying, it's difficult to make things because mafia. of the fuck we started. The mafia. Yeah. Because of the fuck we before, moving forward, we can't have perfection. And I'm just saying to you, there's some of the reasons why. And I believe that's the reason why. Because yeah. of their fuckery, remember, they would have made more laws than anybody else. Because of their fuckery, it's difficult moving forward. But also, depending on what type of tribe you are, you know, you might be buried alive. You yeah. know what I mean? You might have your face burned. No, you yeah, might have your penis yeah, chopped yeah. off. There's a tribe in <laughs> Liberia that learned <laughs> everything from the Americans. And no. they came, they out here doing cannibalism. All now, of I that. I fully hear from, you. But man need to know, once upon a time, there was no white people. There was still, there was only us. Yes. Do you think nobody stole? I don't know. A man stole. Hundred percent. Oh, oh. Bro, you're trying to tell me if I'm over here with my family, you're over there across the river with your family. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Having the maddest party. I can't come over there and steal one orange, yeah, brother. Exactly. Just <laughs> one. How do you know I won't give it to you? Using, that's the life we bro, live they're now. they're using oranges as gums over there. No, no shut up. Man. My, man's got, my man's got the oranges on his ears, dancing by the fire. I'm saying, yo! <laughs> brother! <laughs> now listen, <laughs> get Nike over, orange listen, orange he's got, Nike he's got watermelons on his crepes. <laughs> <laughs> when these times he can come over here, where the, where, the, where the ground is where the ground is soft and we can both nyam the watermelon. But no, we can't hear. This is his baddest watermelon shoe. I for steal it. I, I for steal his shoe. No, we have I'm to steal it. Bro, it's, 
I need the watermelon crap. No, I need the watermelon crap now. No, what, no, what, what I'd like to think need the is, is we, back then systems got created off, off, you know them ones. So this problem has happened now. Let's sort it out now. No. You understand? Mm. You get I, me? Yeah, I could be wrong, but I think back in the day, everyone reckoned, because no matter what, if you're bad or you're good, you need mm. people. Mm. It doesn't matter what, it doesn't matter who you are, you need people. Mm. So I just think maybe back in the day, the use for people was more to benefit them. Mm. Could be wrong. If you're part of a village, you was an integral figure. So yeah. if you didn't bring the water, we're all thirsty. Yeah. I don't mind that type of... But now, it's like, it's the opposite. We still need people, but we need people to work for us and it benefits us, but it doesn't benefit them. Mm. And they got to figure out the code to get out, which is more of what I see today. That's society, why I'm like, that's society, that's society yeah, fair yeah, enough. Yeah. But also, do you know what? There's another aspect of it as well, yes, because you know what? You could, it, it could open up the conversation about like whether you are, whether you can be born evil in some way, shape or form, yeah? Mm. And you may not necessarily be able to be, you may not be born evil, but you could be born with something that gives you a lack of ability to be able to either deal with people, socialise or whatever, yeah? Mm. And I think that sometimes when we think about these things, we think about it in recent times. Yeah. We, when we look back at like however many millions of years ago, I just, I'm just, I don't know this for a fact, but I just believe that I could easily see how there would have been a you or a, a, a young boy or a young girl or whatever that was born without the ability to be able to just handle being around people. And imagine being in a peaceful in a peaceful community where there's someone who's causing a little bit of fuckery. <laughs> yeah. Then they've caused some type of fuckery and, and they've done that out of, you know, an illness. Yeah. Not out of just wickedness. Yeah. Yeah. But guess what now? I don't know that. Yeah. We, don't, we, no, don't, understand come, we don't know about yeah. all that. Yeah. All I know is that made me feel a certain so way. Go so wickedness now is going to follow me now because of... And then what does that do? That just becomes a cycle. And it just keeps going on and on and on and on and on. Then it splits up communities and shit yeah. like that. You know what, my, this tribe has to be over here. We're going to do this thing over there. And then it just gets mad and it just gets worse and worse nah, and worse right. until someone does come in and start saying, all right, you know, we need you to start looking like at... this and this like yeah, that yeah. and this like... Yeah, man. But then in that, it's like you're always going to have someone who's born with a some type of defect. Do you get what I'm saying? Are you saying that they they have the inability to to see that that person is different? Because I was watching a documentary, uh, the Michael Jordan thing, and Phil Jackson was talking about how um, Dennis Rodman was like a Hayoka, and the Native Americans had people called Hayoka, so backwards walking people who were just different to the tribe. That's what they called them, Hayoka, which means backwards walking. They were just different to the tribe, and they recognised them, and they left them alone. If a tribe can recognise that, they have the ability, everyone Mm. can have the ability to recognise a backwards walking person, somebody that's just different to everyone else. Yeah, but that's your. Uh, when you say a backwards walking person, you're talking about a physical, them literally walking backwards. No, 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 no just, 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 just backwards. backwards. But you know what oh, it is? Okay. Even though, even, but I reckon, even with the Native American Indians or whoever it was, they probably had to get to that point. So it's like, they didn't get there straight away. Yeah, it so was it's like, like they've dashed yeah. seven men off the mountain. It's like, hold on, every, every man. <laughs> Every, every man we dashed off the mountain, they, they was kind of moving, they yeah, was kind of yeah, moving away, you know. Backwards worker, yo, yeah, exactly, let yeah, the yeah. next one live. Let the next one live, cause we're just gonna dash all of them. All of them yeah, exactly. Bottom, yeah, bottom of the mountain is crowded. Yeah, okay. Bottom of the bottom of the mountain is crowded, you know. Yeah, yeah. Can't even, there's flies, there's flies. So in it, 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 and it, a pink it takes that, there. It takes that to be able to understand. <laughs> yeah, it, yeah, you know what I'm saying? I, I hear you, but I hear you gotta think here. Yeah, the first time it happened, if it, if it resulted in that some type of murder. Yeah. If it, if, if it, if that happened, if there was some type of murder oh. in that, regardless of the understanding, that made me feel some type mm, of way. Yeah. yeah. You yeah. get what I'm saying? Yeah. So, boom. All right, boom. Howlers, have you got some? That's mad. It's mad when you think about the world at certain times, you know? Yeah, that's crazy, bro. We, do you need to go into teaching, bro. I'm mad. Do you know what? I'm gonna. I got some some hood lessons coming. I know a lot of shit for no reason. Hood lessons. Oh yeah. You, you doing it? You're just yeah. bad, especially on, history. You know things. Yeah, I know things for no reason. Bro. But you know what it is your dad, isn't it? Yeah, it's my pop. Hundred percent. My just TV. Remember, we're from the TV era. Yeah, yeah, yeah. TV. I'll sit there and watch History Channel yeah. if, if it didn't mean I had to go do the washing up. No, mum, yeah, watch, watch it. We're watching it. Yeah, yeah. And on top of that, and it's educational, so she can't take me away. Yeah, yeah, bear yeah. repeats. <laughs> you know that, that. There's bear repeats on TV back in the day. Yeah, I'm watching the Keenan and Kel episode I've seen a million oh, all the times. times. Yeah, and yeah. It, you don't matter. It don't matter. No. You're still watching it. I don't Start care. 
You took the crew from. Was it? I took the screw from the tuna. At one point, oh, I knew that scene. There's yeah. one scene I knew. I'll tell you word. something that no one knows. Go on. Go on. No, that's the first. First episode. episode. Thank you. When I found that, that out, that's my the head first ever was episode. Gone. First ever. That's episode. the first ever Man, episode of Kim and Kel. My head Facts. was gone when I, I found that, that out. I said this is my favorite episode. What do you mean it's the first? I said it's the first. I said they started like that. Nah, they're too much. Man. And that's why they were so cold. Yeah, hundred. Do you know what? Let me go. To Poets howlers. Let's go. The thing is, I'm sharing the howlers this week. You know. Go on. Because the guy I'm going to bring this week. Yeah, man. I want to share them. I want to share them. So let me go to the first one. Let me find one of the people that I brought in to tell me about a howlers. A guy called Henchy. He couldn't make it today. This guy is bigger than absolutely everyone on planet Earth. I hope so. That would have been a howler in itself. <sighs> Small Henchy. That's weird. Take a look at this clip. From is it is this called K pop? But what's it called? It's called oh, K Brock. K Brock, big K, man. K what kind of headache is this? The only head that would have prevented this, I feel, is like a heady one head, would have just bounced back off. This person's head here. Yeah. You know he survived. Big, he yeah. survived. He got up straight away apparently. What? Oh, and boy. said like that. I'm all right. I'm all right. On oh, God, he scratched his arm. Let me, let me K-pop man are androids. Let me show you what Henchy <laughs> had to say. <laughs> Henchy, no he, he went like this. You know when you, there's no bounce. No, when a man falls and there's no bounce, <laughs> something permanent happens. You know what he looked like though. No. You get <laughs> me real? <laughs> no, because sometimes you might do the. A man said. Nah, you can go on, you can It looked like, you know the cartridge going into the Mega Drive? Lodged in! Lodged! Are you I'm I feeling bad. Oh, shit. This is what Henchy had to say, though. Yo, poet. What's good, my dog? It's Henchy. Crazy times right now. I don't know if you've seen the video where the LED screen fell on a man on a dancer at a show. That's all crazy, bro. What a howler. What an absolute stinker. Man's going to have PTSD from that. You know how that goes sometimes. Go Anything screen bro. related. The screen's going to trigger him. Like, Man can't get in his car because of the windscreen and that. Won't go to the fair because they don't know who wrote the screenplay. See? Right. <laughs> Man, that's a screenwriter. Like, I don't even know how far <laughs> this could go. I just know that the company that put that show on, they need to look deep into their savings. Deep, because that boy needs some bread. Yeah. Some Next, listen. Them. When he went to the hospital and said he had a headache, they took it serious. Yeah, he said I'm okay because he heard children screaming in the crowd in that. Yeah, <laughs> so yeah, as soon yeah. as the crowd was clearing, he was back on the floor. Yeah, yeah. Twist up. Twist no, no, no. Up. But you know what? Actually, my spine, though. <laughs> my brethren did send me something as a response. This is what one of the guys had to say in social media. Chan wrote, "Sorry for making everyone worry. Not even worried. Worry." I was too focused on my words, only some bruises, I'm a lucky man. According to the South China Morning Post, you lot of fucking liars. I ain't going to China anyway. Big man, there is no way he apologised to everybody else after a flipping screen bigger than anything I've seen at Old Trafford drop on it's my a head. It's a clone. I mean, he's, he's a clone. He had a new him in the back. Huh? Just really. He's apologising. Yeah, he's apologising. It's a clone. It's a clone. It's a clone. That's so fucking... I don't even know if China's real, you know. I don't know if China's real, bro. I'm screaming it's a clone. Yeah, it has to I'm be. screaming it's a clone. Oh, how? Sure. How? How? Let me go to my likes because there's more. Do you know how fucking big that TV Bro. screen is? Brother. Bro, even if that just drops on your forearm, that's oh, you're gone. You're finished. You're finished. Yeah, you're finished. From a distance. Even if it falls on you flat like that, yeah, yeah, you're, you're in problems, bro. If you're not there to... Yeah, for it to just drop. Nah, it's first hey, Oh, my. Now, this is why you're my brother. You're my brother. Now, this is why I want people to really focus on characters like myself, Charky, Lippy, all of us. I see sometimes we get bare love. I get bare love. But sometimes there's a bit of abuse. And I think to myself, you lot should have grown up in the 90s. Yeah. You think say, I'm bad? Let me show you what's happening on Oprah Winfrey. Bear in mind, I think Oprah you know Winfrey already, yeah. might be the only black person in the whole building. That includes the toilet cleaner. That includes the camera people. That even includes the reception and at the yeah. desk. I don't know if there's any other black people in this building, but I want you to hear the dialogue. Uh, white niggers and black niggers. Where is she? Stand up and say that if you don't mind. Please. Yes. 
Very quickly, what I was saying, and I try to teach this to my children. We live in a Christian community, and looking around this room, the majority of these people seem like Christians, and they seem like God-fearing people. I want to say, if you're going to say nigger, which is a terrible word to me, you have to open it to both races because black okay. people. Okay. All right. What? Listen. Let Alan. Let Alan. Let Alan. Let Alan. Let Alan. No. No. Just let no. Support. No. Let Chuck. Chuck needs to hear it. 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 Let yeah, me, no, let this, me, there's a baby on the track. Let and they're going to skid Take the them off. All right, cool. Come on. People are the same inside. Nigger, no, let me, if you want let me to be both races, you need to hear the reasoning. If you're going to say nigger, which is a terrible word to me, you have to open it to both races because black people and white people are the same inside. Nigger, if you want to explain it like that, there are some of those here today. Other than Oprah. She's not a nigger. Sorry, Oprah. <laughs> They said she's not a nigger. You white people are niggers, but some black people are niggers as well. I don't know. What do I say to that? Yeah, because you know what it is. Shall I be honest? Shall I be really, really real? I only want you to be honest. Now nah, let me be honest. Go true. I see. She tried to do well. What do you some mean? Some people are just racist. No, nah, she. Do you? Hear oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Some people are just she, racist. She basically tried to say. Not only black people, because basically, what's happened before that is someone's <laughs> I get where you're going someone has explained what a nigger is. She's right. saying, but some white people fit that description. So hear what I'm saying. Some of us are niggers as well, but it's like, hold on, Margaret, man. Remove the N word from that, and that's great reasoning I hear that you, you're Margaret. doing. But yeah. with the whole, because some of us are nigg. Nah, man. For me, I just found it a little bit of a howler. All right. I think I've got the final because, um, one. Oprah's yeah, so that's an interesting one still. Yeah? Because it's like, if, you, if you're if you saying, if someone is saying that a nigger is a certain type of person, yeah, mm -hmm. that moves or acts a certain type of way with a negative connotation, then she's a, what she's trying to say is just that, yeah, there's, other, there's people that move like that, that are not black people, so then you call them that too. Yeah. Do you know what but, we stop but, the reason is a mess. But it's just it's it's first sentence of ba the madness. Ba ba babes, just yeah, just allow just, it. Just allow be quiet. Yeah, just be just quiet. Just be quiet. You ain't got to find the yeah, reason. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That. It's not you. It's Do you understand what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. Let us debate yeah, this yeah, one. Yeah, sit yeah. yeah. <laughs> just shut your mouth. Yeah, clap just when shut you up. say a reason. Yeah, yeah clap just when you say a reason. Yeah, clap. Yeah, just shut up. Stand up and clap. Yeah, they'll see that you're on our side. But this shut up. It's too much. Just shut up. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah? I, hope that, I hope that woman knows better now. I hope she does I as hope well. Hope anyone will f teach her something. Bro. Yeah, man, just shut up. Oh, what an idiot, brother. Just shut up. Another example. I just feel where white people go just too far. <laughs> too far. Here's the furthest I've seen white people go. I think Castillo found this out for me. I just think of in my heart of hearts. When I separate the communities, it's because I respect the differences, and most importantly, some of the worst examples is nothing I recognise. Mm. Absolutely not. I don't recognise these bad behaviours. I'm not saying our bad behaviours in our community are any better, but these bad behaviours here... The Hulk Hogan really fucked up my life. It really did. My best friend, Hulk Hogan, lived with me at his lowest point of his life in 2007. He was sh My wife calls me and Hogan's down. He's going through the worst fucking divorce uh, ever. And I, I just told him, I said, hey, Heather, have a little sexy outfit on and, and, and take care of my boy when we get home. I did let him my wife. You are. Thank you, Castillo, by the way, my guy. Castillo fans a lot of fuckery in it. Castillo I need to know. It's, so it's, it's much fuckery. Right. Bring him on a couch, please. No, we have yeah, to. Yeah, yeah, you you got, you we got, have you to. Got, you we got, have you got, to. You we got, have to. You think I got stories? You think I got files? Yo, listen to him. His files crazy. His brother, he, he's Castillo's like me. That's who's my bro. We just know shit that we should not know. We just know. You hear about that Russian girl? She got licked by lightning and then she. And he just knows shit. Got saved by a fish. Like he just, he just, he just, he just, he just, he just, he just know this. He'll know all the info. Like saved by a fish. Yeah, no, nah, literally. Got saved by salmon. Yeah. Oh, saved by salmon. Yeah. Well, my brother, right now, I just think, and the reason why I, I've never known in my community anyone to take in their best friend and not only give them the Wi-Fi password, not only give them food on a Sunday. Not only take them out to nice little restaurants, number five in Hornsey, shout them out. You tell your girlfriend, lay down on her back and the man's going to watch go. the rest of the video though. Oh my God, we're what getting happened? to that. We're going to carry on. We just a little in, in, uh, intervene. Uh, what, what's really going on here, bruv? Listen to him. When he said, take care of my boy, he meant like, like, make me in a casserole or something. Like, <laughs> like make me in a casserole. Ah! <laughs> 
Me and my mother That's casserole. Hey. The surveillance system got captivated it as it captivates everything. Had an employee of mine not steal my fucking my surveillance, uh, only three people to this day would still know about that event. And my life wouldn't have been ruined. Uh, my ex wife wouldn't be considered a. And Hogan wouldn't have 141 million dollars in his pocket. So let's let's let's. Oh. Do, do, do you understand what you explained there? So he's basically said his Hulk Hogan is his best was his best friend, right? Best Hulk friend. Hogan having sex with his wife was planned. That was all good. He said Hulk. It was bleeped out, but he said Hulk Hogan was in a bad way. He wanted to take his own life. So what he did to help his friend? Fuck is, my girl. Give him yeah. You know what? Fuck, what? What? You know, what? Yeah, no, that's, I, that's them. That's that's how they. Right. This is what I'm no, saying. Let's, let's open this up now, then. Shall we? What was that conversation like? Yo, babes, hear what I'm saying, yeah? Mm-hmm. My Don's going through a few things and whatnot, still. So. And he could, you know what? I think to stop him from, you know, what I mean, jumping in front of the whatnot now. I think you should give him some of that good pussy. Is that what was taking him off the stairs? Give no, him. That took him off the stairs. That day it did. You and he got 100 no. foot. But little did he know, gone. He had CCTV in his yard. His security man stole the footage. Went, made it go viral. Then cut a deal with Hulk Hogan. Hulk Hogan got what? Would you say 151 million? 141. Over it. Hun- but what? Just, a hundred, what? Is they sold again? the sex tape. They sold it, brother. Kim K. No, this is my brother. No, this is, Wait, is that the one where he was in the room? Because I remember there was like um. There was a sex tape of him in like a bedroom chop. That's the same Don. That's it. That's the same. Oh, that's I saw it. that. That's, yeah, that's old still. Yeah, like, no, that's 2007. The, the, right. the Hulk Hogan sex tape. So, and that was to save him from jumping off the fucking thing. No, do you know what it is? Give me 100 mil right now. And we forgot, we've forgotten about all of this, bro. 141 million. And you're, you're a wrestler already. Let me wait, hold on, wait, one second. Let me get this straight. Get he straight. was about to fucking wig himself, essentially. Yeah. Yes. He chops his brethren's missus and he gets 100 mil. That, that, not the 141. Pum pum bring life. 141. Your pum pum bring pum, life. Pum, 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 pum. Did he break off? Bring the, life, did he break rice. off? Do you know what it is? Did he I'm, break off? He's, the he's moving like he didn't, but he must have, man. He's got to break them off. He's got to break them off. He's got My man sounds better. Hulk, let's have it right. 07. Hulk Hogan was beyond rich. Yeah, back big, 07. Big rich. 97. Well, we don't know. We don't know, though. Do you know what we don't know? Because he went to WCW at that time. I don't know what was happening in Natural. So he might have been a. He might have been a down the financial state. Obviously, he came back up. We know how it ended. But he might have had a little yeah. weird middle period. Yeah, I hear that story. And now all I'm saying is, for me personally, personally, I want to share many things in my life, even my success. Mm-hmm. But you see, my woman. Yeah, not that. No, you're not chopping my. Woman. Sometimes I don't even want to. I don't even want her to share herself with her. If I ask my missus to do that, and she what? <laughs> don't play with yourself. I'm here. I hear you. I hear that. Have you ever had that? Have you ever had that? Yeah, I've had that. Yeah, yeah. What? Yeah, where you chop that and then she just put like. It's it's like, I'm in up. the room, you know. You like gotta get in her, her view and that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here. The way you take control of that is by telling them to do it. Yeah, yeah, of yeah, course. Babe, that. could you do, do that? that? Yeah, yeah, you yeah. Do then that she's right doing it. Now, you understand you... what I'm saying? Yeah. I just fact. sit on my couch now and just watch and just, that. Yeah. And I beat my one. I like. <laughs> deep. Nah, it's facts though. It's that, bro. <laughs> Tip for tat, you gotta fight back. You can't. She's banging you in your face. <laughs> you saw the fight, get your hands up. Boy. Let me tell you Have you ever done that? Have you not done that? She's just, and I'm on the bed just. But beating my one. Nah, 69 for us. We're both for two artists. Nah, I hate you, I hate you. <laughs> Dive in! I hate Dive you. Dive in! Why should I not be now, involved? I'm not like that though. I just, huh? Obviously, the nut's still with her. Yeah, but I just thought you got a, you got a ma- you got a match energy. Yeah, <laughs> you got match I can't energy. lose this yeah, thing right here. <laughs> oh shit, she played that card. I'm right. telling you, I'm telling you, lippy every oh, time. Sugar coming true, brother. Nah, I love man, love. Yeah, it's family, been a minute. Man. It should, it's should never have been two years. That's nah, crazy. Andrew, nah, I hear that man. That's what I was no, thinking. You know, when I, I was like, yeah, it, lo- it was lockdown, lockdown, innit? National, was it lo- yeah, it was maybe just just before it. Oh, Nash out everything. But yeah, nah, man, soon day again, man. Yeah, the man, them, listen, the man whenever them. you're ready, man, you yeah. can be like whenever. If there's something that's happening and you want to just talk yeah. about or whatever. Yeah, say no more, hundred percent. Yeah. And you know what? We I should get him before the boxing yeah, the boxing match. We have to get him this. Um, Who's boxing match? When you're when you're having a boxing match, December, December, oh, yeah, before December, the boxing right, match. Yeah. And on a real one, Lippy, brother, fam. Chucky Sean, I was at the last one. From mm. then till now, bro, everything you've achieved is fucking it's amazing, incredible, bro. It's crazy, bro. It's crazy, bro. It's we won't crazy. even reveal the thing that happened on Wednesday, but it was a moment, brother. Like, a I moment. can't lie. Man sitting moment. down like, this is a moment. Well, I'll tell you again off camera, obviously, yeah. 
um, always tell you East Africa as well. But yeah, bro, it's like when you messaged today, I was like, do you know what? Let me try, you know, bro, like. I woke up today. Because you know what it is? I woke up today, I was a little, little name drop. I woke up today from DMs from Declan Rice today. Strong. Yeah, oh, man. De- but Declan's a real one, you no, know. Real one. Real, real one. one. I love Declan. I can't lie. Real, real, real. Move real to Arsenal. One. I Please. just see Declan I, in I, the I, middle. I ain't sent that message yet, but it's it, we're, we're, we're leaning towards that. that but you know what it is? It's like, as much as I rate myself and I, I love the fact that we're all doing this, we deserve yeah, to be yeah, here. Yeah. Yeah. It's still mad, though. Yeah, mad yeah. It's like, let's have it right, bro. This is, this is crazy. And it's like, we're genuine brethren, bro. Yeah. Now, when these cameras are off, it's yeah, not, yeah, yeah, yeah. fuck no, man you, fuck man. with each other. Yeah, we yeah, fuck yeah. with each other. Do you know that's so the, it's, it's that's beautiful, beautiful bro. That that's is genuine thing. love. You and do you know what I think it is as well, bro? I just think yeah. it's sick that, like, each man represents something, in it? And I think yeah. that you, like, where you come from and what you represent is, um, is so inspiring to them, man. Do you get yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 because yeah, yeah. at a point... You know the stigma. Man ain't going on camera and talking about. Yeah, I'm not, yeah, not doing yeah, it yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. You, people are seeing there's a it's real a avenue, a for, yeah. and and there's value just being yourself. Being yourself, man. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. If you would have come down and started speaking a certain way and changing all of that up or whatnot, then blessings ain't gonna happen. Hundred, because it's not you. Hundred, you get what I'm saying? There's you know, a value yeah, being you. That's a hundred percent. I have to say, yeah, yeah, but you've been preaching that from early. Yeah, as you're, well. you've been an advocate for be I, you, and you can't be nobody no else. Can, nobody. You understand? No one's a better you than you. Trust when you, me. When the you them know this, we're all kings. We're again, good in it. Yeah, yeah, man. man. Well, imagine we're all friends and we do this. To oh, it's crazy. Yeah, it's crazy. crazy. You know how much man make millions and the man they're sitting next to you in the boardroom, they fucking hate him, bro. They yeah. don't know they hate. Brother. You get me, bro? Not not man even hate him, but we got genuine love for each other, bro. Yeah, really a man can cool, ring bro. my phone. We will rap for hours. Yeah. If my you as a party, if a, whatever, I will. You, you man include it. It's not yeah. even. You see me? Yeah, it's yeah, not a second yeah, thought, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And just the fact that we're in this space, man can't, yeah. man can't, man can't little man it. No, 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 no. Come on, my bro. It's family, it's family. And also, family. Chucky, I'm just going to say it one more time. He has had a sensational week. That's all I'll oh, say. Yeah, yeah, You've yeah, just got mad chance. Still. Yeah, I've had a good one, man. Honourable shout out to, yeah, man. Fuck you now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like that. Thanks for listening, everyone, yeah? Bonus play.